National Volunteer Month kicks off in just a few days, celebrating the incredible impact that volunteers have had across the nation. And Big Brothers, Big Sisters of America is teaming up with the NFL, I like this, to change the game. Yeah, it's such a fun thing. They're mm -hmm. calling it the Big Draft, and they're aiming to recruit mentors who will make a lasting difference in the lives of young people. From Big Brothers, Big Sisters of America, please welcome President and CEO Arta Stevens, and from the New York Jets, Solomon Thomas. Hey, hey, hey! Woo. All right, so let's start with you. I mean, how huge is this partnership? Yeah, it's incredible. So Big Brothers Big Sisters is the largest youth mentoring organization in the country. And our goal is to create more access and opportunity for young people. But today we have 30,000 kids on our waiting list, 30,000. Most of those young people are boys. So we're looking to attract more men as mentors. And then we teamed up with the NFL to say, well, how can we create something really special together? And we called it the Big Draft Campaign. And the concept is simple. As the NFL is drafting the next round of players, they're hoping us to draft the next round of mentors, right, to create that level of access. And then we set up this website, website called BeBigNow.org, where people can go on board, raise their, hand, raise their hand, get involved, get engaged in support, uh, and be these incredible advocates and mentors like my man here, Solomon. Imagine Imagine having Solomon as a mentor, yeah. right? <laughs> so talk about the importance of mentoring. Yeah, uh, mentorship's been so big in my life. Um, it's created the man that I'm supposed to be today. Um, all of my mentors in my life have made me um, go through all the social things I've been through, academics, sports, everything. And uh, the crazy thing is there's so many youth who need mentors. Um, one in three youth do not have a positive mentor to look up to. So it's so important for us to give back our experiences, everything we've been through, so we can help lead the, lead the new mentors and the new youth of our life. Um, they're the ones who are going to build our future, who are going to be the next presidents, be the next engineers. Um, so it's so important for us to give back to them so they can feel valued, feel important, and just live the best life that they can live. Well, what do you say to people who say it feels like another job? I don't have time to mentor. Well, the biggest thing for me is mentoring has impacted me so much because of how my mentees impact me. Um, every time I do an event and the littles come, um, I leave so much more um, motivated just from the things that they've been through. Like I, at my Christmas Christmas event with my littles, um, like they're all smiling, having the best time ever. And I go talk to the bigs and I ask them, hey, what have they been through recently? And they're talking about things like, hey, their mom just passed away. Hey, you know, their sisters ran away from home. And all these things, and they're smiling, having the best time ever. And just shows their perseverance, their resiliency, and just their optimism for life. Um, it's truly impacted me so much. And um, if you're afraid, if you're afraid of the time commitment, you have the time and you have you know the space in your life to give back to others and I promise you they will impact you more than you impact them. Mm. They will fill your cup up for mm -hmm. sure. Definitely. What does it mean to have someone like Solomon giving of his time giving to these kids? Yeah it, it is it is what we say in Big Brothers Big Sisters all the time and and what we all know well and even how I grew up and what I see in Solomon and it's this term if you can see it you can be it, mm -hmm. right? So, so often what we need in our communities is just role models, exposure, access, right? And you have all this potential out there with young people in every single community, and they just have, need the opportunity to be able to connect and see people who've come from some of the same places they come from, who can make it, who can achieve. And one of the things we really believe is this idea, right, that you don't have to be perfect to be a mentor. Mm. You just got to be present, that part, right? Yeah. Present and persistent in a young person's life. And as Solomon said, 90% of our bids say that the young person made more impact in their lives than they made in theirs, right? So we know that mentorship is not one way, it's reciprocal. And when we all join together to be able to bring people together in these incredible ways, we create this awesome impact that not only makes our kids better, but make our community and our country that much better as well. I'd love to hear that. And Solomon, you're very busy. You actually founded the Defensive Line. That's a nonprofit organization that focuses on training, education, and mental health. Mm -hmm. I love that part. Why is it important to have that? Um, it's so important for me. Um, my personal experience, I lost my sister to suicide in 2018. And, you know, as a man and as a man in the NFL, I didn't feel like I could talk about it. I didn't feel like I could go to therapy. And I went through a really dark time and, you know, almost lost myself um, into suicide ideation. Um, but, you know, through therapy, through work, I got back to being myself. And I understood the importance of mental health after being in the work. And I saw how many people feel alone, how many people feel like they can't talk, how many people feel like they can't go to therapy. Um, so I'm, I'm out here. I'm trying to advocate for those who don't have a voice, who are suffering in silence, because way too many people here are suffering and, and suicide is a is the most preventable death. And if we talk about it, if we show people the resources, um, the more we talk about it, the more we keep people here and keep people alive. So it's extremely important to me and my family and, and just this world. We lose way too many people to suicide. Mm -hmm.
Thank you right, guys, so much yeah, for being here, artist Solomon, both for sharing your stories and for encouraging people. And you guys go out there. What's the website? Be big. Be big now dot org. And go Solomon. Solomon. Go Jets, right? Go Jets. <laughs> Jets. 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 Thank you again. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.